Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing an Ariana Grande inspired makeup tutorial. I'm going to be recreating her makeup look that she used in the music video with Lady Gaga. But the hair and the aesthetics of this look is just Ariana Grande inspired. It's not inspired by the music video. So Ariana Grande is known for her really, really long hair and a ponytail. So I and each air actually reached out to me asking if I wanted to work with them and they'll send me some free products to try out. And I like it I can mention it in a video and I do really really like their ponytail this ponytail I really really wanted to use it in this video since Ariana signature look is a ponytail but if you want to have the Ariana Grande inspired ponytail literally the exact one that she uses because Ariana has used hair extensions from this company they actually have the ponytail called Maya and that's the same one that Ariana has used in your previous music video this one obviously has tinsel in it and Ariana Grande doesn't use this one but I wanted the one with tinsel because I feel like I'll get the most use out of it so I incorporated it in this video although it's like kind of Ariana like kind of not I think it's really fun and cute still nonetheless it's really cute if you guys are wondering the quality of the wig or the extension is actually really really nice quality and it's super easy to put on on top of that if you guys want a discount off of your order you can use the code SheilaBilly10 I don't make any money off of it I think they just give me the code so then you guys if you guys want to purchase it you can get a discount with your order and then my contacts that I'm wearing today they are let me get them. They are the Ocure Kristen from HoppaKristen.com. And as always, you can use my code SheilaBooey10 for 10% off of your order on Hoppa Kristen. This is usually the website where I get all of my color contacts from. I really like them. They're really, really natural today. It just makes my pupils a little bit bigger, which I really like and which is exactly what I wanted since the eye look is so dramatic. And before I get started, I just want to let you guys know that you are now watching a YouTube channel of a college graduate. I finally graduated with a bachelor in health science and a minor in marketing. And aka if any company wants to hire me, let me know. But yeah, I just finished school. I told you guys I would take a little bit of a YouTube break due to finals. Well, I finished finals and I'm right back to filming videos for you guys. Let me know what other video requests you want me to film in the future down below. And as always, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up for me, and let's get started. I'm going to take the Maybelline Dewy Fresh Foundation in the shade 128 and applying that all over my face. I know this is out of order, but I kind of forgot to do this before the foundation, but I'm going to cream contour my cheekbones. I usually like to do this before my foundation, just because I feel like it looks more natural if you do it before, but it's okay to do it on top of your foundation. Just taking my Kat Von D contour, I'm not precise with my contour, I don't really care because it always ends up looking good anyways because you just blend it out with your beauty blender. Ariana has really, really strong cheekbones, jawline, and her face in general is just a lot smaller than mine. So I'm going to be highlighting my face with the Maybelline Fit Me in Light. I have gotten a lot paler due to quarantine, so my foundation and color is a little bit lighter than normal. Taking my favorite Givenchy powder of all time. You guys know I love this powder. I talk about it all the time. It's just a translucent powder. I'm going to be setting my entire face. Go to sleep at night. This is a finished result for my eyebrows. Now I'm taking the Anastasia gel and I'm going to putting this all over my eyebrows. This is going to help it look darker. So I'm using this one. It's called the Kate Palette. It's a real lasting eyeliner. This has been one of my favorite eyeliners of all time. It's from Japan, but you can get it from Amazon. Super cheap and super, like, it's so good. I love it. If you mess with your eyeliner or it's just like not how you want them to be, I just take one of these little Q-tip things I got from Ulta. It literally cleans it right off. Ari has this white huge eyeliner on her eyes, so we are going to recreate that with NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. Night. 
I'm going to be taking the Physicians Formula Bronzer and I'm going to be bronzing up my entire face. Ariana is known to have really tanned, bronzy, glowy skin with really contoured cheekbones. So we are also going to be recreating that. Next, we're taking my favorite Kat Von D contour powder. We're going to contour my cheekbones up to the gods because Ariana has the highest cheekbones ever. They're super, super sharp, so we're going to be recreating that. I'm not too sure if Ariana was wearing blush, but just have a little bit of like a fleshy color on her cheeks. I'm taking the Neutrogena blush in the shade 20. And I'm just going to be applying it like this. The last final steps, I'm going to be finishing up my eyes. I'm going to be taking a black pencil liner and lining my lower lash line. Then I'm taking Ardell's Double Wispies and using them for the falsies in this look. For my lips, I'm going to be taking the Wet n Wild Lip Liner in Willow. Of course, you guys already know, Ariana's signature lip look is very big, voluminous lips. So I will be overlining my lips to try to recreate hers. Then I'm taking this Wet n Wild lipstick in Close Off. Then to get that signature Ariana glossy lips, I'm just taking a clear gloss from Wet n Wild. Now I'm going to be taking some highlighter from Anastasia. This is the Emsery highlight, Emsery, Emsery, Emsery. I don't know, but it's a highlighter from Anastasia. I am going to be highlighting my entire body so I can literally look like I'm glowing. This is the finished result. Let me know what you guys think. I don't usually do something this dramatic on my channel, but I have been studying so hard and your girl is officially done with school, so I thought I would switch it up, do something fun and different. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!